Welcome back. Uh, I'm going to do another mail call. Sorry for no videos here in Calgary. It was really, really hot the last couple of weeks. Really smoky from all the forest fires in BC. And it made sitting here doing videos very hot work. So I decided to take a break and not do anything and just say cool. But things have cooled down. We've had rain. In fact, today is rain. So I can do all these stuff again. So there's a number of items. Let's begin with this guy and I toss our little thing over there so these guys I saw them on another channel and I like the idea this piece here there's two types in here so there is the female and the male but the idea is um, I have a power adapter here and I want to plug it into something voila so then I can put some pins in here and then plug it into a board like this so like this I have some pins they can screw and then I can just unplug it like this so this should be one two three four five of those five of the other ones I think that was a good idea I like the idea next item this looks like an adreno or something like that but it actually is it's actually um what was it called again let me just open it first you know and i need my scissors here we go let's leave them out because i might need them again This is a Cypress Logic Analyzer. You, it's programmable, so you can add program. There's a whole bunch of software for this, uh, any multi, any platform. And then all these guys, you can do 16 channel logic analysts, anal analytics with this. And with the software, you get those cute little uh, logic analyzer graphs. So power button, reset, these guys Ooh. there we go so I really wanted to try this out because you can spend a lot of money in the industry on logic analyzers so we will find out you know, just put this back in here Let's put it over here. And another item we have. Now, the light bulb upstairs that I got, the one that was in here, was one brand of this light bulb. Now, I got the other light bulb here. And I think this one, yeah, this one is narrower. The other one is bigger, but yay. So I'm hoping I don't have to actually cut the reflector shell on the light if I just replace it with this one. And this is a little weird. The other one is really, really clear glass. This has a, got a big rubber coating on it. So I think this one is really uh, <laughs> waterproof. <laughs> but I'm dying to try that out. You'll need that. Now, another item I've got in here is this guy here. So, this is another wheel of LEDs. So, 
So this is just a single color one. This is what they come in. Now this is a different white, I believe. I'll have to uh, power it up and find out. Okay, what else do I got here? So I went and got this a while back to look, and it even has a light on it. But I wanted to try another item. So this guy here. So this is supposed to be like a little jeweler's thing. Uh, let's see. Whoa. So uh, let's say I was looking at this little resistor here. Uh, wow, completely out of focus. Mm. Well, I have to say, it looks cute and everything, is, but it's useless. The focus range is too short. Even though it's got a cute little bag. It's a dud. But luckily this thing only was worth a couple of bucks. Woo. They even have instructions for it. <laughs> I love this. It's not ultraviolet. Man, that is bad. Well, I said this is a dud. Well, at least for me it is because we have to wear glasses and stuff. Maybe if I took the glasses off or something, it might work better. But no, I don't think so. Now, p putting leads into these and stuff like that, I wanted um, and this thing, you know, be able to do these type of clamps. I went and got two different suppliers of these things. So this uh, ah, there we go. So this one here is pins. I don't know why my red pin is in on the yellow oranges. Not to go guys, you need to be in your own little bins. And over here there seems to be an orange one in the white bin. Boy this is bad. Actually no. There we go. So they're different diameters. Wow, I have a green one in here. That's not standard. Oh. Well, anyway. But the idea is... See these? I could put a cable on these. And they would fit into here. I have to figure out how to use them. So that was one side. And then I specifically got solderable version of this. So this is a 1.5-4. No, what's this one? Okay, so they belong together. So as you can see in here, for example, this did 
Da -da. And they're solderable. So put a little heat shrink tubing, put the wire on there, and do the soldering, and voila, I've got a U-clamp. All sizes in here. So, garbage. Now, did I put one item? Where did I put it? Well, I did get a UPS too, and I haven't put it in place. I did get a new Dremel tool. It's sick. So I had that other Dremel tool and I returned it because it was broken. So I ended up getting this one, which is I thought a better deal. This was about 48 bucks. And not only did I get the tool, I also got the accessory I really was interested in. This thing. It's that flexible tubing thing that you can use to attach to the to tool. Got the kit. Even uh, if I choose to use it, some sort of routery thing, right? So even there's um, a handle thing here, makes it like a gun, and then a bunch of parts and stuff, and looks like a reasonably well built. I actually already attached the piece to it. But it feels really good. And it had another thing I really liked was not just an on off, but an adjustable speed thing right in the top right away. Right? So, I thought that was a pretty good deal. This came from Amazon. And I'm going to try this out later. So that is it for all the mail so far. There's other items coming, of course. <laughs> I tend to buy items and then they trickle in. Kind of like a perpetual Christmas gifts. Coming up mostly from AliExpress. So... That's it for this mail call. I am going to hopefully this weekend do um, show off this piece. These guys that I bought on another mail showed off on another mail call, and now that I got these. I think I'm going to refix my light power supply thing on the other power supply that's up there at the moment. So, and then there's some soldering I have to do. I still have to put all these m minis together. And then there's this to put together and this to put together <laughs> and this one to put together. So, I'm going to try all those out. And we'll see. So, see you in the next video. Have a nice day.